Hello! Uh, do you know about hair tail fish? You may not know, but we love to cook it because it has a soft fish fillet and delicious. So we enjoy hair tail fish in many ways. Fry it, braise it, salt it, and in some southern cities, people even have it raw. Believe it or not, it's an expensive fish in Korea. If it is big and from Jeju Island, then it could be priced up to almost $90 for just one fish. Uh, I wanted to show you how to cook it after I heard that some people in western countries don't eat it and when they catch this fish, they just use it as bait. So today, we are going to make braised hair tail fish with radish. Are you ready? Let's get started! This is healthy fish and a fishmonger cut it into 6 pieces for me. And we also need 1 potato, 300 grams of radish, a half onion, 2 large green onions, and hot peppers. Now please slice the veggies like this. We are going to put aside other veggies and bring a boiled sliced radish and 600 milliliters of anchovy broth for 5 minutes. While waiting for it, let's make the sauce. Add 3 tablespoons of soy sauce, 2 tablespoons of oligosaccharide, half a tablespoon of sugar, 1 teaspoon of salt, 1 tablespoon of ginger juice, 1 tablespoon of minced garlic, 1 tablespoon of red pepper paste, 2 tablespoons of red pepper powder, 2 tablespoons of cooking wine, and a little perilla oil. Next, please wash hair tail fish in running water. Remove the scales from a fish with a knife like this. And cut the fins with scissors. It's almost done. Let's go to the pot and put sliced onion, potato, trimmed hair tail fish, the sauce, green onion, and hot peppers in order. Turn on your stove to high heat and turn down it to medium when it starts boiling. Please simmer them for 20 or 25 minutes. It's done. I hope you will try this once. Thank you for watching this video. I will be back with another nice recipe next week. See you!